Hi there, my name is Daniel and in this short guide, I'm going to show you the simplest way to create forms in Notion and gather submissions right into your Notion database. So the first step is to create a database where you want to keep your submissions. So head into your Notion setup, create a new database. Let's see, test database. And that's it for now. We will head to step two, which is opening Simple Inks Notion Form Creator. You can find this under forms.simple.ink. You open this page and just simply click on create uh, a form. And as you can see, there's a button that will disappear. So that button will appear for you if you log in for the first time. And you will need to press that button in order to get, give access to um, simple link to access your uh, Notion workplace. So it will look something like this, right? So you can just select the pages that you want uh, to use and click allow access. Okay, and after that, you will see the same thing that I can see right here. As you can see, it's already here, my test database that I just created. And we just press continue. <clears throat> and that's it. Your form is almost live. And uh, now, as you can see, we only have name and tags. But uh, the cool thing is that you don't really need to do anything here. You can just uh, do the changes in your Notion database. So if I add the new property, let's say new select property. Right, we give you two options, yes and no. And uh, let's add another one for an email. Right, and now if we go back and we refresh the page, Then, as you can see, it, it's already updated it. And you can change the order here. Name, email, tags, isn't this cool? Right? And you, of course, you have different kind of customization options. For example, you can change the color of the button. And you can see it changed the, the button. Let's see if we want a black one. Right, and you have also advanced mode where uh, a couple of customization options are behind a paywall. But if you don't need, for example, to remove the simple link branding, then this uh, this is uh, fine for you. There's no limit on submissions, so you can just use uh, this uh, simple form as you want. And all you have to do now is to uh, click on embed form button, take the link from there and just paste it where, wherever you want it to use it. So let's just create a new page. Test form and just paste it in and press embed. And that's it. Now, if you share this website with anyone, then they can just simply uh, give their information. Submit. And now if we go back to our test database, as you can see, we have the submission already here. So it will appear instantly. And that's it. So there are really three steps. You have to create a database. You have to connect your Notion setup, your Notion workplace to simple.ink's forms creator and just simply edit it as you want. Then take the embed code, put it uh, inside your Notion page or WordPress page or wherever you want, and you can start gathering submissions for your form. I hope that this helped and if you have any questions, leave a comment below and see you in the next one.